When it comes to installing your GPU for the first time as a new builder, you may not know exactly what to do. So today we're going to basically show you exactly what to do and what not to do. And I've made mistakes during this video actually trying to actually put the GPU in. So don't worry, you're not the only one who's having problems. So if you learned something, make sure you like and subscribe. And in the next video, I'll be doing the SSD as you can see. And let's get into it and teach you how to build this. Usually your motherboard comes with two SATA cores. This one, which is an angled one, which um, may help you in depending on your setup. And this one, which is a non-angled one. So when it comes to which one would you want to choose, um, it's personally up to you. But the angled one for me, this one, will probably work best as it is, uh, it will make it easy for me to reach the actual SSD if I use this angled one. So that's the one I am going to use. So I'm gonna put it through here. Yeah, and then there's a, I don't know if you guys can really see, but the cords, the cords right here. And um, let me actually show you. So the cord, this is the ports that you wanna plug it into. And you just plug it in into one of these. Like so, it'll clip in just like that. And um, you don't have to, Worry about it until you actually put in your SSD. But um, yeah, that's all there is to plugging in that cord. And then once we get the SSD, we will do that part later and then do figure that out later. But for now, let's actually install the GPU. And we wanna first start off by taking this off. Now, okay, that came off easier <laughs> than expected. Um, so, now that you've taken that off, you need to have taken that off because the GPU needs to sit in there and it needs to come out like that. So taking that off was actually important. Now, when it comes to installing this guy, you first wanna take all of these. Okay, so an important piece that I missed here was uh, there's back like panel protectors on the back of the case. Um, like where you put the actual ports to your HDMI out and your GP and your other display ports. Um, and you have to take those out as well. And you can see it's right under the IO panel. Um, you take, you don't take out the first vent, you take out the two under that first vent. Um, and I forgot to say this in the tutorial. So, I'm gonna skip to that part and skip this part because I made a small mistake. So let's get back to it. Take out because they are in the way. So to do this, you actually unscrew this right here. screw I still have and we'll just pop these out so you put the screws to the side now that we have both of those out um now that we have that out the back plating out which basically uh, stopped us from putting it in. We can now simply put the GPU in our desired slot, which is this one. We'll make sure everything's lined up. By first, you want to line it up. Is everything lined up? Yes. Then you just want to put it in. That simple. 
now that it's all in, we just want to, you guys see this part right here. All right, now that, those are currently not screwed in. So your case comes with screws for that. And these are how the screws look like. Hold on, let it, let it focus. These are how the screws look like. You take these screws and you screw them in into these slots right here because there's little slots for the screws. And once you do that, your GPU is ready to go. To screw it slightly in beforehand and then put, um, and then tighten it down like this. And once you tighten it down, your GPU will not go anywhere. Now it is officially in place. Um, and now you could do the same long, same thing with the other screw and just slowly use your finger to, cause there's two screw holes. Um, when you put your GPU in, you'll actually see this um, screwdriver. And then you screw that in and boom, your GPU is now installed. Um, now the next thing you want to do is now that you have your GPU officially in and officially uh, working, as you can see, I have such bad lighting. Reinstall this guy. Reinstall this backplate. Um, this is the last part for the GPU, and uh, you should be good to go. And now everything is set. You just take these guys off um well i'm gonna be using hdmi so i honestly don't need to take these other guys off but i'm gonna do it anyway because why not and always remember to have like a grounding on point because that just is the safest way to go when it comes to pc building all right now the build is coming together guys um now you see i have motherboard fans already in uh gpu